there was a confrontation with her ex-boyfriend when I wasn't here, and she, we couldn't find her and couldn't get her to answer. Okay. And I walked back here, and I found her dead. That's the 911 call that came in from Ripley Day Hill Road yesterday morning. The body of 62-year-old Marsha Thigpen was found by a friend near her pickup truck. It's in the back. There's a hanger back here, and she's lying dead next to her truck. I okay. think she's been shot in the head. Neighbors can't believe this could happen to someone they say was such a kind and loving person. It's a shock for everybody out here. And it's, it hits so close to home, it just makes it worse, makes everybody kind of a little uneasy and worried. We hope uh, sheriffs can take care of it quick and everything gets resolved. And it's hard to believe that anybody would want to do anything to her, really. Uh, she's a great woman. It's just kind of a crazy world we live in right now. You heard that neighbor say that he hoped that the sheriff could handle this in a rather quick manner, and he did. Actually, this has been a 24-hour period in which that crime, uh, the woman was found, and the time that uh, the sheriff has now charged this man with uh, aggravated murder. Uh, John Crum uh, is being held here in the jail. He will face a judge first thing in the morning. Reporting live, I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT News 5.